Hello, this is Chris Yost at Bullion RV in beautiful Duluth, Minnesota. Today is Wednesday, March 10th, 2021, and behind me, right off the truck, is a brand new 2021 Grand Design Solitude S-Class 3740BH fifth wheel. We're gonna show you around the outside, show you the inside, see what you guys think. Very excited to have a high profile bunkhouse in stock. Haven't had one in a while. Obviously you got the redesigned, new color on the outside of the Solitude. All laminated fiberglass exterior, aluminum frame walls, heated and closed underbelly. Here's that beautiful front cap. It's got LED lights there and there for at night as well. Take a walk under here. Look at all that storage. It's nice and high too, so you can put bikes up in there if you want. This coach is just under 13,900 pounds dry. Four slides. Show you in here, you got a 30 pound LP tank on both sides. We fill those for you. We put a brand new 27 series deep cycle battery on board for you as well. Here's your hookup center, outside shower, black tank flush. The valve poles right there, cable and satellite hookup. And of course, you can't forget your auto leveling right there. Hit a button, walk away. Doesn't get much easier than that. Just over 40 feet long. You have your 10 gallon water heater. This is 50 amp service on this unit. It does have two air conditioners. Look way around to the back here. Full walk on roof. This is backup camera prep there. A lot of folks these days are going that route so they can see what's behind you when you're driving or if you're hauling something. Here's that hitch on the back with the four prong plug. Whether you use it for towing something or just for a bike rack, it's there. Look at this awesome outside kitchen. Everything you need. Fridge, place to hook up the TV so you can watch the game. Sink and a grill. Whatever you want, it's there. That's going to be a second exit or entrance right to the half bathroom. Look at these two power LED lit awnings. So you don't lose patio space off this slide. Outside speakers for blaring your van heel at the campground. Got the awesome sturdy fold up aluminum steps. Entry assist handle fold away. Can't beat those. Your battery disconnect hiding up in there. Right there, you can see that awesome weld aluminum framing there. And there is heat right here coming down to this area. In case you want to throw the kids in there as you're going down the road. Just kidding. We wouldn't do that to the kids. Not unless we put a vent in there so they could breathe. Let's walk inside. Posing slides. Look at all that room. Salt surface counters. As soon as you walk in the door here, you can have your monitor panel right here. It tells you the levels of your tanks. They're all empty, that's a good thing. Gas electric water heater, of course. Here are your 12 volt heated pad switches. So yesterday here in Duluth, it was 60 degrees. Today it's gonna to be 35 and we got about eight inches of snow coming tonight. So you never know when you're gonna need those. Awning switches, slide switches here, all individual switches. A lot of people like that. And right to the right here is also a touchpad that you can act activate those things as well. And you, with this LCI app, which is right here, you can download that to your cell phone. Your cell phone can become a remote control where you can operate the lights, the slides, the awnings, all from your cell phone. Can't beat that. Look at this, no carpet. Makes it so easy to clean. Got your six foot dinette right there, makes it down to a bed. Look at the awesome windows. Wouldn't that be an awesome view? Not looking at that guy's camper there, but looking at the lake when you're there. Thomas Paine Theater seating. Look at all that counter space. Got a stainless steel sink. Got the sprayer here for keeping people out of the kitchen area. This is optioned out with the uh, 110 re uh, residential fridge, so it's the 3740R. Got your Furion oven, the windows, you can see what you're cooking. Nice drawer underneath for pans and a spot to put pans when you're cooking. Got your 
your TV, of course your fireplace that puts about 5200 BTUs of heat. Look at this awesome door. Close off the kids or the guests who's ever with you. And what's nice about back here is you got a bunk and that can be pushed up out of the way if you want because down here you got your sofa so you can fold that out to sleep two adults if you want. Or this could be like a little den area so I want a little time alone to read or relax or take a nap. Nice long bunk there. Look at this, you'll never complain. Look at all that storage. Whether it's for you or the kids, you'll never complain about that. You throw that TV up there so if he wants to watch the game, he can sit right here, watch the game. She can have the TV out there, everybody's happy. And here's a bathroom that he can stink up. Or the kids, so they're not coming up by your bedroom and bugging you in the middle of the night. Awesome light fixture up there. Once again, two air conditioning air conditioner units ducted. A little area here to set your cell phones to charge them or throw the coffee pot, whatever you want. Even for those folks that say, hey, what am I do with that area up there? You'll find something to put up there. Crock pot, hide your chocolate, whatever you want. Look at this, awesome pantry. Even give you a waste basket. So for those bathroom emergencies, look at this, we got no carpet on the stairs. So if you had to, you can come in the camper, right up these stairs, and into the bathroom without touching any carpet. Porcelain toilet, of course, and they even put uh, solid surface counters in the bathroom. They don't skimp on you there. And look at the size of this shower. I'll tell you what, so we'll do this. So I'm 6'2", I'm not gonna be coming with you, but as you can see, even I got plenty of room to get clean in here. They even give you a nice fixture there. Almost residential, not quite, but pretty darn nice. Into the master suite, suite here. Look at all that storage. One thing you'll never complain about is too much of that. Bedroom TV, more drawers here, ball bearing drawer glides. And of course, look at the size of this, it's almost a walk-in closet. Look at all that room. And it is washer dryer prepped. So in case you're on the road or had to live in this thing, or if it was your camper at the campground, like your cabin away from home, you can put a washer on one side, dryer on the other. If you don't like the all-in-one combination units. Once again, no carpet to walk on. Put down your own throw rugs if you want. Just an awesome high profile bunkhouse fifth wheel that you can travel with. You can put in the campground. Whatever you want to do. Oh, don't forget that. Look at that natural light skylight right there. Those rainy days let in a little extra natural light. Once again, this is Chris Yost, AKA Camp and Chris here at Bullion RV in Duluth. For those of you who don't know where Duluth, Minnesota is, if you're looking at a map of the US, we're at the far western tip of Lake Superior, or about two and a half hours due north of Minneapolis, St. Paul. If you have any interest in this unit, feel free to call or text me anytime, day or night, 218-393-1472. We're living in a weird year here. We're getting over this pandemic. There's not a lot of these on the ground. If, if you guys need some help getting into one of these, let me know, give me a call. I'll help you out the best I can no matter where you're at. So feel free to give me a call, stay safe, and happy camping.